need organization. There's issues with the guys. There's inventory issues on the trucks, tool issues with the guys. You know what I mean? We need to, you know, apply these principles of clarity, alignment, and accountability, and I need to get it done. And I've already been making some changes since I've been on the phone. I got some guys that have bad attitudes, but they're not clear. You know what I mean? We're not aligned. You, you know what I mean? So those those are truck inventory. You know what I mean? That's all that stuff that's got to be done. But immediately, you know, it's important for me to guy to make sure that the guys do well. Because if the guys do well, everybody is going to do well. The monetary value is it's off the hook. I mean, I mean uh, you know, if you apply it, what is it worth? It's freaking infinite. You know, you know what I mean? It's it's really going to be based upon the effort that you're going to put in to implement what it is he's being he's being taught it's an, it's incredibly powerful it's incredibly incredibly powerful and the fact that we're in the facility and you're standing here and i mean geez, the shop is is there the guys are right there i mean i met a i made it a point to meet a bunch of guys and i've asked a bunch of them you know how do you like working here and they all solid handshake looking in the eye and they're like wouldn't work anywhere else. Wouldn't does that mean every day is perfect? No, but you know what I mean. When you get a guy to say that, not one person has had. Not even not that I would expect him to say, "Oh, this place sucks." No, you know what I mean. These guys have been, you know, their their eye contact, their facial expression, their body language has been all positive, and you know, it reinforces the culture. And I mean, you know what I mean. It's like if he did it anywhere else, you know, if you went to. Uh, if we're going to a hotel for this, I, don't, I mean, you know, his, his words and everything would be effective, but it drives it home so much more that we're here and we're in, inside this operation, you know, and the CSR room is right there, you know, you, know, you know what I mean? And like I said, it's just, it's incredibly powerful, incredibly powerful. What, you're, what is being taught is applicable throughout your life. It's not just your business, it's your personal life. And if you want, you got to commit, you got to commit. So either, either what's the you know, shit or get off the pot, you know, you know what I mean? That's really what it comes down to. If you're not happy, what are you going to do about it? Are you going to just wallow in misery or are you going to, you know, get it together and and make something happen and come you know if you think it, you if you think it's 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 too much money if you come here and learn this stuff and implement it i don't see any way it's not going to pay for itself i mean that just that doesn't even seem possible you, you know what i mean and you know if, if you think that you can't make it work you have a limiting belief and that's one of the things that he'll come here and show you that you know what i mean it's it's not true it's not true and if you're if you don't want to make the commitment to yourself you're not going to make the commitment to your customer you've already failed you've already failed go do something else you know what i mean and the thing is go do something completely different but you know what it probably won't change because you have to make the change you, you know what i mean no matter what you do you are you no matter where you go in the country no matter where you, what you do for a living you are always you so if that doesn't change what else will